Courtney and I are going to model for you uh, just a couple of rounds of the game um, from the Let's Make a Deal show called Stick or Switch. And this is um, some data that you will collect and analyze for yourself, but we're just going to do a couple of rounds of the game so you'll know how to play it um, and collect your own empirical data. The game is there's a car behind one of the doors, and behind the other two doors is a goat, which is not a prize. Getting a goat counts as losing. So Courtney's, I'm going to randomly select, and I just have on pieces of paper you can draw out of a hat, just so that I don't bias myself against the door. I'm going to choose out of a hat which door has the car. And then Courtney's going to choose a, a door um, that she thinks that the prize is behind. I'll then show her a door that she did not choose but that has a goat. And Courtney will decide if she's going to switch her choice or stick with the, her original choice. And we'll see um, after several rounds if there is any advantage to sticking with your original choice or switching. We'll just do a few rounds so you'll get an idea. Um, you will play this 20 times while you're the host, and you'll be 20 times as the contestant so that you will get enough data to, uh, to make a decision. Okay, I'm going to choose this door. Courtney's not going to look. This is the door with the car. Okay. So, Courtney, choose a door that you think it prizes. Door number two. Okay. Courtney chooses door number two. I'm going to show Courtney that there's a goat behind door number one. Do you want to change your door to door number three, or do you want to stay with door number two? Stay with door number two. Okay. She decides to stay with door number two, and now I'll show her there's a car behind door number three. So Courtney won a goat this, this time. Um, we're going to count that as losing. Okay. Let's try another round. Okay, so Courtney's not going to look. I'm going to choose out of a hat. Here is where the prize is. Okay, Courtney, you want to choose a door? One. So Courtney chooses door number one, and I'm going to show Courtney behind door number three, there is a goat. Do you want to stay with door number one, or do you want to switch to door number two? Switch. Okay, so Courtney's going to switch to door number two, and there's actually um, a car behind door number one, and so she lost again this time. Okay, let's try one more time. Um, without Courtney's not looking, I'm going to draw out of a hat. Here's where the prize is. Okay. Choose your door. Three. Okay. So Courtney chooses door number three. Now I'm going to show Courtney that behind door number two, there's a goat. Do you want to stay with door number three, or do you want to switch to door number one? Switch. Okay. This time, Courtney is going to switch, and there is a car behind door number three. So Courtney won a goat again. I'm just going to give Courtney one more chance because I feel sorry for her. I'm going to draw one more time out of a hat. Courtney's not looking. Here's where the car is. Okay. And Courtney, choose a door. One. Okay. Door number one. Now I'm going to show Courtney that there is a goat behind door number two. It's a door that she did not choose and it doesn't have the car. So, I'm sorry, it's a, sort of that it's a door that has a goat and she did not choose it. Are you going to stay with door number one or switch to three? Switch. Okay. So Courtney switched to door number three and poor Courtney has such bad luck. She lost again, but she does go home with four goats. Um, but you can try this and collect 20 times, 20 games when you're as the host and 20 games as you, with you as the contestant and then follow the directions on the rest of the lab.